can almost pay these off. 9,600. And I can't just do just like a big lump, just like, here's a couple thousand for them, so... Unfortunately, that's out. Yesterday wasn't quite so great. Sunday was a little bit lackluster compared, but still 848 profit. Still pretty good, don't get me wrong. I expected a little bit more though for Sunday, but that's eh, fine. That's okay. Head back over to school, get a few more hours of education, work again, and I think we can get this going for uh, Wednesday. We can probably look to hire somebody. I need to talk to the marketing people and see if that's still active or what. I feel like if it is active, it's no longer worth the hundred bucks that I'm spending. Whoops. That I'm no longer spending on it. There we are. And now we can discard that. Quick restock. Just kind of going through the motions already. <laughs> Just how the beginning is, I think, though. Like, you could probably take out, like... Your first loan, if you don't set up the business wrong and waste a few thousand bucks, you could probably get maybe two businesses going with the first loan. Perhaps. Where's this last dirt at? Hello? Oh, okay, got it. Hmm. But we should have the money to pay off one of my loans, though I'm not actually sure if I do. Or like if I bother. It's only nine bucks per day I'm paying in interest. Not a whole lot. Like eventually over the course of the 200 some days, it's going to equate to be a couple thousand bucks. But that's a few years from now in game. I don't think is too bad. So I might just see about buying the van then, let those loans exist, start throwing some money into investments, and uh, start profiting off of the interest. Might even take the day off today and just pound out the education required to hire employees and get that going. Four hours is all that's needed? Okay, let's do it. Start setting for the four hours. And then boom, it's done, and we're just, we're a little bit late coming into work. That's okay, I slept in. It's fine. <laughs> That's okay. It's finished now, though, so I can call the recruiter when we get into the store and uh, have them start looking for someone for me. Yeah? All right. Maybe get a third loan going as well for, uh, for a couple more businesses and really hammer it out. Contacts, e-marketing, call. Okay, so I guess we're not advertising anymore? I'm not sure how long that was going. I didn't see an option to choose how long that was going for. I don't know. Exemplary gifts, looking for a customer service. Age group doesn't really matter. Look for four candidates. But take your time with it. It's kind of whatever. Okay, and with you looking for four people across 10 days, I feel like you'll be contacting me really shortly for some more. We'll have to, I think, tomorrow. Um, when does the wholesale place open? I'll never remember. Okay, they open at 8. So tomorrow we can get a restock. Can I also get a vehicle. I can also get a vehicle. It'll be Wednesday? Yeah. Okay. We can get my van back. We can go pick up a restock and we can bring it on over. Nice. We, uh... Yeah, okay, good. <laughs> wasn't, wasn't sure what was happening there. Oh, uh, you know what else I can maybe do? And not just restock my place, but also maybe get another shelf and go for the expensive flowers or so. That might be worth it. I gotta see if it's still worth doing. I should also probably take a look at the market thing more often. Maybe there's some days where it's like the import price index just plummets and it's like really cheap. 
think cheap flour maybe went up by 0.1. I'm not fully certain, but yeah, expensive flowers are still there as a thing, and... Yeah, I don't know how to do donuts, but that could be cool too. Donuts are expensive, though. Ugh. Well, yeah, expensive flowers. So we're still doing cheap gift. Expensive gift is kind of whatever. I don't think it's worth that. But expensive flowers we can maybe pick up as well. Or maybe I just get rid of cheap flowers and I just rock expensive flowers then. Maybe that. We just put the cheap flowers on... There's six cheap flowers left. I'll just put those on the back shelf and just let them wilt away and die. <laughs> Maybe? Try out expensive flowers regardless, I think. Taking my van back. <laughs> I don't really need it yet, but when it comes time to open up a new restaurant or... Uh, fast food place or just another general store or something like that then it's gonna be really nice to have this because then I can pick up like decorative furniture and also stock slash inventory for places and yeah it'll be it'll be really nice and yeah to the wholesale here because it really blew with it the car that you get in the story where it's just the eight which at the time is really nice but when it comes time to restock everything and yeah uh, it really really quickly became not enough so can i just like pull up next to it and click no okay well well that's expensive gift not that discard those Get rid of them. Expensive flowers, though. Hands are already full. Oh, yeah, right. I forgot. I'm bad at this. She's a little too quick. Park it. Hand truck. Throw it in. And jump into the, into the car. I really don't like the clicking everything. I'm really struggling sometimes with that. Because, like, the windows always, like, pop up and move. And you gotta click the button. But sometimes it's not the button you click. Sometimes it's just the thing that you click. Ah. Wow, expensive jewelry. 63 grand. That's, um... That's a thing. <laughs> Peace. There's expensive flowers. Cheap flowers we're kind of passing on. Cheap gifts I need more of. Don't know if I can afford all this. What do you got in there? Oh no, that seems fine. Paper bags we were plenty okay on as well. So we're substituting the wedding in queue. Oh God. Okay, there we go. Substituting the cheap flowers for expensive flowers to see how that gets on. I suspect it won't be a massive difference, but I don't know. Because like, I think the I think the expensive stuff is mostly just for like upper class and we're we're largely just middle class so it, I'm not sure if there's going to be a big enough difference there, you know. Expensive flower stocked. Assigned. Okay. See how that goes. Good news, it's actually kind of sort of selling. Not, not bad. It's not like a ton, but it is better than zero. Which is a little bit what I expected was... <laughs> not being so good to sell here. But hey, turned out to be just fine. So, don't have any more expensive flowers, but we can restock cheap gifts. The paper bags. Throw this stuff on the shelf, except the... Paper bag, cheap gift. The cheap flowers just get to sit there. They're in deep storage. 
I would like a new hand truck to bring out to my van. Let's see about bringing the rest of the stuff inside. 612 bucks. I wasn't open the whole day though, and I spent a bunch of money. So, doesn't fully count. Man, the parking situation on the street. Off, move. The parking situation on the street is tragic sometimes. Jeez, gotta stop like, oof, up by the stoplight up here. And then and touching the sidewalk so it's illegal and ow. Eight bucks to park at my house, by the way. I think I bring my bed into work. <laughs> I think I just sleep in the back room again. It seemed to be fine. I can keep the apartment. Bringing this with me. Eh, no. Grab it. Carry it. Bring it out. I'm a little tempted to see about waking up at like 5 in the morning to see if I can score a good parking spot. <laughs> I don't know how it figures uh, what spots are open, but like, everything else on the street is closed today. <laughs> Awful. Very bad news for me. So we're placing this there. And then we need a little bit of a restock. The expensive flowers, everything else is fine. So there you go. My lunch, running a little bit low on. But okay. I'm gonna... I'm gonna see how... That spot works. I'm curious to try to, like, have this out by the front door, since they walk down here all the time anyway. So, there you go. Do we like that? <sighs> wonder how many people I can actually fit in here. With this in here, because the line can only be so long. And I feel like they're just going to stand here, so like, one, two, three, and that's it. Yep. Pretty much. So, on a sun, we're moving this back. Back to here. Okay. Down to 16 of 25 flowers. Sold almost 60 cheap gifts as well. It's definitely not not performing. It's it's going quite well, I think. If we get some employees in here and we like actually get them trained up so they're not, you know, running the business into the ground, then awesome. Because I feel like um, like our customer service scores in the story were like. 20 and 30 percent i think so the store was not going very well because of that people were having a kind of miserable time here and i think that's just like our customer service scale might be like 50 or 60 or something so we train an employee up and they're like as good as we are to some extent or alternatively we train them up to be like a hundred percent and they're like wow super good Better than we could ever be. Oh yeah, I got the bed in there. Right. Haha. -ha. I forgot. Waking up at 741 now. I wonder if I can move the car into a better spot now. 646 profit. I mean, we got the auto thing going now too. I'm not sure what the auto costs every day. Revenue fourteen hundred bucks. Public parking for the UMC Desert sixty eight bucks. Oh god, that's per hour. So much worse. Okay, marketing campaigns are still going on. Yo, marketing campaign. How do I not? What? I don't wanna. Make it end. <laughs> oh yeah, look at that parking spot. <laughs> Gonna yoink that real fast. 
stop in the middle of the... Okay. You see, here it's free. Here, I'm okay with. Now, um... Marketing. I'll run there because I got a cool spot and I refuse to lose it. Marketing we gotta fix. And... I gotta buy more food at some point as well. I think I'd take a walk in the park as well just for a bit of happen. I don't know if it affects like the customer experience if I'm in a good mood or anything. I don't know. Marketing agency. You there, stop. Can you just not? It just doesn't? Because, like, what if I go for a large campaign, then? And we'd be getting, like, more and more people, or what? Because if I can't cancel it, then I assume that there's no reason to cancel it, so... No, screw it. Let's go for a large campaign. I don't know. Have a little wander around the park, consider life choices, and then see about buying some groceries. So late to work. We got the big marketing thing going. Oh, at least it's not timed, apparently. It just goes on forever. So, like, I guess if you can afford to do it, then go for it, because it should pay for itself if you can't cancel it, or if you're not setting the amount of days for it to run. I don't see why it wouldn't just, you know, like, I think you just, you buy the marketing campaign and then it's just, you're good, you're set, that's it, that's all. Business marketed, yes, and you move on with life and things are cool. That's how it seems to be. It's only 500 bucks a day for a business that it was making like a thousand bucks per day almost with just the basic marketing so maybe we're making like 1600 bucks per day with this marketing included find out see how busy this place gets hi hello it's me i work here <laughs> we're open <laughs> feels like a pretty ordinary day Nothing much going on. Pretty much like yesterday. Granted, we opened a little bit late, but still. Um, nothing crazy. But maybe it takes a day for the marketing to kick in. I don't know. Maybe it's not instant. We will see what happens. As per usual. Just kind of, I don't know. Just winging it, really. I feel like the tutorial is one of those things where like it teaches you to do stuff, but you don't really know why you're doing it per se it's an issue that i have with a lot of tutorials where it's they either baby you and handhold you too much to where you don't know why you're doing stuff because it's telling you what to do all the time this one's a little more hands-off with it and you can generally like do your own thing still did make a bit of profit that's nice so our happiness is still good um but like i'm not really seeing why we're doing stuff like why we took the courses i don't know why we had to do that um, marketing we never learned how to do in the tutorial, but I'm just kind of assuming it doesn't really tell you why you're marketing. I don't see the marketing effects anywhere. I don't... I don't know. But, uh... Yeah, I don't think we were even paying for the marketing yesterday, it looks like. There's day 20, minus... Minus 600 now. So we have a small campaign, and also a large campaign, I guess? Ugh. Alright, well... See how that goes, I guess. Grab a... Expensive flower, two, cheap gift, and paper bag. Restock our cheap gifts, and we are ready to go!
Okay, this definitely made a big impact. That was a significantly busier day. That was just sustained, constant, almost 100 cheap gifts sold, 10 expensive flowers sold. That was big. I almost couldn't fit in a lunch break. <laughs> that was a bit heavy. So I think it probably pays for itself, though I'm not sure if the large web campaign is a good idea for this business because I don't think it has enough of the uh, the general baseline foot traffic based on its location. I don't think that's enough to necessitate a large campaign. I think a medium would have probably been fine. Since there's no way to cancel it, though, I don't know. Like, I almost wonder what happens if you just take out a big loan and you throw, like, you make, like, eight big marketing campaigns all at the same time. 800 profit. That's quite okay. It's not the thousand that we once had, but maybe if I get some cheap flowers in as well, we can, like, really compound some stuff going to give up my potential excellent location here. I no longer need a supermarket. Marketing agency we don't care about. Furniture store I don't really care about right now. Recruitment agencies, whatever. Wholesales. And subway station. They open in one hour. Are you guys open? No. They're closed on Sundays. Uh, furniture store. That was the other one, because I need, like, a shelving unit. No, not furniture store. No, no, no. Um, uh, appliance store. They're also closed on Sunday. They open in two hours. Okay, so we'll swing by those guys on the way back, then. Because I'm going to see about getting some... I don't know, maybe soda? There's like more stuff to sell and see what that does for us. It's a gift shop, but we also sell this, 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 and that. Get customers to buy more things when they come in rather than just like... Because I don't think they're going to go ahead and buy eight cheap gifts, but they might buy a couple cheap gifts and, ex and an expensive gift and also a couple cheap flowers and expensive flour and a soda or something. Oof. 1700 bucks for a couple sodas, expensive gift, and I forget what else or something else. So back up to my business and we see about picking up another shelf and slash or drinks machine. I think this is the wrong turn. I don't really know my way around yet. Oh no, we're good. Okay, drinks fridge is a little bit much. There's got to be a better like display shelf, right? Somewhere. It can't be that this is it. Just this store doesn't have it, but they're by far the most convenient <laughs> place to go. I don't know. We'll, uh, we'll throw these in and hopefully that helps us out. Just get them to buy more things. And thankfully, our excellent spot is still available. Fantastic news. Look at that spot. Man, I wouldn't give that parking up for anything. I would need a food and hand truck. I don't know why our key bindings are like P and like F for some stuff. Uh, I got to go through it like rebind just this entire game to something that makes more sense. Park vehicle, the storage, not inside. A hand truck, expensive gift, soda, drinks fridge, round the table. Get in there! 
rounded shelf rather. So that's being placed here. Expensive gifts, which there you go. Drinks fridge. Placing that at the start for soda cans. Excellent. Can't find a register. Give me a minute. I'm assigned. We're good. Expensive flowers, cheap gifts, expensive gifts, soda cans. Okay. And then cheap flowers we can maybe also offload through another shelf, but again, I I I gotta see about like another shelf in existence somewhere. Like if I go to I don't think I looked into you. Uh, pallet shelf, product panel? Product panel sounds promising. 500 bucks for that, it's a small little thing. Yeah, all right. So that looks like a pretty okay spot to stop in at some point then. Grab up the panels, maybe like two of them. Cause like the expensive flowers, there's only, there's only 25 per box. So I'm not sure if like, the rounded shelf seems like such a waste. It, it, cause I, I don't know if it matters. Cause like, it fits one box of thing per shelf. I don't know. With the big, huge mass marketing going on and all these products for them to buy. Like, look at these dudes hoovering up just everything. Look at that guy. Yeah, I think this is the way to do it, man. I think this is, this is the trick here. Just get stuff. Like they're complaining about not having a register because there's not enough room. That's... stop. That's how awesome this is. Oof, what a teleport. <laughs> there, is that maybe a little bit better? There's just so many people in here at once sometimes. I almost need a second register. <laughs> Hopefully the recruitment gets back to me pretty soon. Ah, uh, yeah. We've sold almost 40 expensive gifts already? Oh my god, like so many people are buying so many things. This is excellent. It's like the king of retail thing that I always had where people would always just come in to buy like one or two things rather than making like a proper grocery chip. Here they're like, yeah, no, I'll take a look at just everything and they don't mind buying like a bit here and a bit there and multiples of that. From what I'm seeing here, big stores are going to be nuts. Looking forward to that. This is a massive breath of fresh air here. I do wish I could cancel marketing campaigns, though. I'm sure there's there's a way for it, I'm sure, right? There has to be. Okay, wow, that was uh, incredible. That was much more than I expected it could ever be. There's expensive flowers, cheap gifts. I don't have expensive gifts on here. Arc, and then expensive flower one. I can sit there. Uh. Right, I don't have expensive gifts. I never bought extra of that. Okay. The drinks, I didn't catch if anybody actually did anything with that. It's looking a little bit like maybe not. Okay, let's... God, I keep clicking. I don't want to click. I just want to move. Ah. Maybe I go with the controller anyway for WSAD support and we just accept that there's like the entrances and exits and everything everywhere all the time. This game's like oddly built for a controller and I don't know why. <gasps> 3,880 total profit. What? Okay, I need to buy more expensive gifts. Expensive gifts, maybe expensive flowers? Cheap flowers or whatever. 
expensive flowers, we had like really just the one. Cheap gift paper bat, expensive flowers. There's another five expensive flowers there. Taking a look also with this AJ Peterson and Sons appliance place that was closed yesterday. Is they've apparently got Yeah. A product panel. Take a look at that. Should I buy two? I might buy a second one. That way we've got it. Cause why not? Oh. Oh, a whole checkout? There's no way that'll fit in my store, though. My place is tiny. Um, I'll buy a trash bin as well, because we have the soda. I don't know. Okay, that, that works out well. A thousand bucks. No problem. Mr. Moneybags over here, 3,881 profit yesterday. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Oh, that feels so good. Okay. Throw that to the side. We need to buy more expensive gifts and stuff. From here. Bought some more expensive gifts, a couple boxes, and also cheap gifts while I was there too. Although cheap gifts I think we're fine on, but eh. If we continue having days with so many customers, then... Better safe than sorry. There. Expensive gifts. Stocked. There's that. And then I will man the register for a bit and see if I can find time to have a little bit of lunch in between. Okay, yeah, somebody did buy a soda. That's good. It It is happening. I didn't remember if I just, like, restocked it or what, but... Cool. And then we can get the little shelfy shelf up for like cheap flowers or something. And there we go. That's like, geez, just about everything that we can have before we start expanding into like really oddball things for a gift shop, like French fries, <laughs> donuts. <laughs> Although to be fair, a box of donuts for a gift. That sounds great. Okay, unassign, consume, place, click, assign, fast forward. Yeah. Phew. It'll be good to get an employee, man. I might have to get a second register soon. And then we gotta start looking at upscaling. Because we don't have that much space <laughs> anymore. <laughs> it could be, though, that the... Um, these round shelves that I've got against a wall... Uh, maybe not the best? I, I don't know. It could be like these have more, like use spots for NPCs, rather than like the little shelf thing that I got, but... Yeah, I didn't know the little shelf thing existed. Okay. So, hand truck. Give me... trash bin, product panels, and more expensive gifts. Product panel, place. Oh yeah, that's a small thing. There's like, drinks on the way out, like, oh! Drinks, that's perfect, that's exactly what I'm after. Um... The product panel, I think we can pack, I don't actually have anything for it, current. Get these windows out of here, man! In the trash bin. Place, get that somewhere there. So I guess you can just be bang. And that's not cheap gift. Oh, it has to be cheap gift, does it? Okay. Well, then this can be cheap flowers then. Fine. See if I care. I don't. Expensive gifts are good to go, so let's box... Park this out of the way, get the cleaning station out. Oh my god. The, the, the hover over windows is a problem for me. I'm not a huge fan of that. 
generally clicking to move I find to be quite annoying, not a fan of that. I'd rather just WSAD and I press E on something to open it and then you can open the window for me. I, I don't know why it's set up this way. It's like this wanted to be a Switch game. I, I don't know. So, hand truck, mandate storage, 2,500-ish that day. Not as good. Expensive gift, cheap gift. Like, I want to move, but I end up clicking some furniture instead, and it just, like, throws it all off. These also don't hold as much. So there's also that. So wait, what do I need? Expensive flowers, maybe paper bags. There's that. And then paper bags. And this is where having employees doing a restocking is quite handy, because it saves you the trouble. And we're wasting a lot of time in trying to sort all of it. Get that on the shelf. Cheap gift, expensive gift, cheap flower. I guess it's fine. Okay. We're sleeping. Waking up at 9.42? Sure. I am glad I bought that shelf unit now. Oh uh, yeah, also some cheap gifts. Run that in here as well. I forgot about another box of that. We spent a lot of money restocking stuff. And so they can. There. day has been incredible. <laughs> like, several thousand dollars incredible, I think. We're down to a third of our cheap gifts left. Expensive gifts, almost 60 of those. Expense the amount of cheap gifts that we used to sell, we sold that many of expensive gifts. Expensive flowers, we sold the normal amount of that. A relatively similar amount for the cheap flowers, and the cheap gifts are just... They're flying out of here. Holy crap. Today was incredible. Here's that. And cheap flowers. And cheap gifts. <laughs> and then I need soda. Expensive flowers. Have the expensive gifts. I'll load. Oh, wait, did you just stack? Like, oh, I guess it does do that. Well, okay. Uh, expensive flowers. And the soda cans and paper bags I don't have on here. So I can stack stuff then. Turns out. So, probably best to just leave stuff on the shelf then all the time. And we just park the dolly when we're done with it. Okay. Yeah, like, sooner we're gonna have to start worrying about things that you wouldn't have really thought about before, like, uh... Midday cleaning. Like, I gotta get in- I have to get an employee to help clean these floors midday because they get disgusting so quickly with all this foot traffic, and... How do I find enough time to take a lunch break while I'm working? Because there's so many customers, and if I leave the register, then they all just abort and exit. Um, stuff like that. It's it's getting there now. It took us a little bit, but I think we're we are getting there with it. 
2,900 profits. Not as much as I felt like. Man. I guess that just goes to show, like, cheap gets are bad. Because we sold a ton of those. There's a lot of customers coming through, but maybe we've just got a little too much not great stuff to sell. I mean, that's still a couple thousand bucks. It was also only a Tuesday, and I think our massive day was, uh... Well, revenue 42, 48. Okay, yesterday was 48. The day before was 42. 59 on day 21. That would have been, what, Sunday? Okay. Well, we're getting there. We should at some point get contacted by... the Recruitment Corp. I would think. Um... Would love to make an investment. Gotta see about the one. I gotta sleep still, man. Whew. Invest some of this money so it can do the work for me.